Welcome to another episode of Simply Sarah. Today on the show, we're going to make a mug cake. A ooey gooey chocolate peanut butter mug cake with a peanut butter icing to go on top. You need a small mug for this. I've tried it in a regular mug, like a large size. It only goes halfway up. Do it in a small mug. In this, I've got two tablespoons of sugar. I'm using Splenda. You can use any other sweetener you want to. You make it how sweet you want it. If you don't want it as, as sweet, start with a tablespoon. Three tablespoons of all-purpose flour. A pinch of salt. A fourth of a teaspoon of baking powder. A tablespoon of unsweetened cocoa powder. If you want it extra chocolatey, then do a tablespoon and a half. Okay, now we're just going to give it a mixy mixy with our dry ingredients in here. Make sure everything is blended real well. Okay, now we're going to add our other stuff in. A tablespoon of peanut butter. Use any kind of peanut butter you want. I'm using a low sugar calm. I mean you could substitute this out for almond butter or any other nut butters that you like. A tablespoon and a half of oil. Just regular old plain oil. I'm using vegetable oil. You can use coconut oil, melted coconut oil, butter if you really wanted to. That's all up to you. Three tablespoons of milk of your choice. I'm using almond milk because that's what I have on hand. Half a teaspoon of vanilla extract. Give it a mixy mixy. I'm starting out slow because I don't want cocoa and flour and sugar flying everywhere. Now to make this extra decadent, you can do a half a tablespoon to a tablespoon of some chocolate chips. And these are the sugar-free chocolate chips. They're more like a dark chocolate semi-sweet ones. And then we're gonna mix them in. And off to the microwave we go. We're going to microwave this on high for about a minute and 10 seconds. All microwaves are different. It depends on how many watts yours is. Here is our mug cake. Now it's gonna rise up, and then when you get it out, it's gonna sink down a little bit. Don't be alarmed. Now, let's make our frosting for it. And this is so simple. We're gonna take a mug, just to mix our ingredients in. I've already got a tablespoon of peanut butter. Cause I want a thick layer of frosting on my cake and so that's a low sugar peanut butter so we're going to add a half a tablespoon of some confectioner sugar but what I'm using is Swerve the ultimate sugar replacer and it is for people that are diabetic or doing low carb it has no no sugar whatsoever and you can use it just like powdered sugar See, it's confectioners. And we're just going to mixy mix this. A tablespoon of milk. We're going to mix it a little bit. We're going to stick that in the microwave for about 10 seconds. Here's your icing after it. Put it in the microwave after 10 seconds. It gets so creamy and not all lumpy. Now, we're just going to put as much as you want on your mug cake. I'm putting it all. Make it real pretty and then um, for a garnish I'm going to come with a little sprinkle of the sugar free chocolate chips sticky a spoon in and there you have it my ooey gooey chocolate and peanut butter mug cake I went down and got a big old scoop so you could see the inside of it see the cake is all the way done you can add some nuts coconut whatever you want to this recipe